This artist was called Vasily Kandinsky. He was a Russian artist who was very famous for his abstract paintings. Abstract is artwork that does not look realistic. It's more artistic, less realistic. Today you will be painting with tissue paper, not paint, but tissue paper, and you're going to create a painting that is abstract. Today we'll do the color, and next week we'll do the lines. We will be filling up an entire white paper with different colors of tissue paper and adding water so the colors will bleed from the tissue onto our paper. First thing we'll do is select some tissue strips and start tearing them into different shapes, some bigger than others, some longer than others, with rough edges. Once you have a nice pile of tissue, it's time to wet your paper. We're only going to wet one spot at a time, drop the tissue on top, and then wet it again. You've got to be very careful with that brush that you don't push the tissue around or ball it up or ruin it. Wet the paper, drop down the tissue, and then carefully put water on top. So there's water under the tissue and water on top of the tissue. We're going to do this one piece at a time. Try to keep your hands clean because if you touch the tissue with wet fingers, some of that color may bleed onto your hands. We want it to bleed onto the paper. Do you see that? Some of the color is leaving the tissue and spreading onto the paper. That's all we can do for part one because now we need to let that tissue paper dry. Leave it on the paper, let it dry overnight, and then when we come back next time for art, we're going to peel all the tissue off and see what kind of colorful stains were left on the paper. Welcome back to part two of our tissue painting. You're going to take all the tissues off and look at this. Here's how it looks before I took the tissue off, and when I peel them off, the colors are still on the paper. It's very soft and blended, and all the colors left the tissue and attached to my white paper. Pick all of them off, because we're going to paint on top of this next. That's how it looks. Isn't that beautiful? We're going to use some black paint to paint lines on top of our colors. Do you remember our artist from last week, Vasily Kandinsky? He created this abstract painting using straight lines, curved lines, wavy lines, thick lines and thin lines, diagonal lines, and even shapes. We can do that same thing by putting black lines on top of our tissue painting.
Notice I'm using water to wet the paint, and every time my brush starts to get dry, I need to add more paint. You need to paint with the tip of the paintbrush so you stay in control of how thick and how thin the line becomes. Notice some of my lines are much thicker than others. Try that in your painting. Try zigzag, spiral, wavy, dotted lines, repeated lines, curved lines, and fill them in with black paint. Fill your whole page.